Yes, yes, I think it's a crucial uh, issue uh, because I, I'm thinking uh, continuously uh, during this day about Visby five years ago. And if you remember, the slogan was from word to action. So what I think is to, we, are, we have to multiply the action. But to multiply the action, what is needed is to have a, a, a positive context. Uh, to do it. So it cannot be just also as mushrooming initiatives that was a traditional way to operate in this uh, region, what is good because it's uh, a signal of the involvement of uh, the individual. But we need also to have, I could say, something that it would be more institutionalized, more structured. And this means that first point is the political willingness. It was mentioned this morning. And not just, I could say, to have a public declaration, but to have a translation of the willingness into the policy forming at national level, into the allocation of funds, the allocation of means, staff, and so on. If this is a key area, because if the political will is there, normally the other difficulty would have solution. So this is the first point. So when I have some, I could say, some comparison of what is happening in other uh, macro region, I'm thinking about the Danube because we have just seen a colleague now. Uh, I see that maybe at the beginning the Danube uh, strategy was much more difficult to, to, to launch because there would not be this ground and tradition of cooperation uh, at the bottom uh, level. But now, now they are taking maybe more, I could say, speed in the process, because had they have not tradition, at the beginning the system, the, the system, the governance was built on more, I could say, institutional involvement. What means that now, has because the ministry have already started to speak together, because at national level they are starting to bring. I could see the macro regional dimension in the perspective, in the planning, um, as a policy in programming, as a financial means. Um, I have the feeling that probably, but has to be seen, uh, they, will, they will take more easily uh, the route towards this, what it is a macro regional dimension. It would be, in fact, how by individual but also coordinated and joint action better serves the specific on national interest because it's the cooperation is just a way to better achieve what you want. What would be your two or three best advices for the key stakeholders to from here onwards that in five years there is a set of real good macro-regional strategies? So I think well, first would be to have a very, as much as possible a strong pressure about the political level and administrative level uh, because uh, both are working, uh, I could say, uh, together. It's not about just policy and politician, it's also about, about administration that they have their own use and habits and so on and a mindset is necessary. So have a pressure for the change of mindset, what it is cooperation about. And to see cooperation as not to give money to others, but really as to uh, how to better achieve your own objective, to solve your problem and to take the benefit of the opportunity. And when you recognize that they are shared, you have shared problem and shared opportunities, uh, the, the, the best way is how you can uh, try to act uh, jointly or in a coordinate way or in covenant way to, 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 to achieve it. The second point is not to focus so much on very specific projects. Yes, it's good that, and in, in particular in the initial phase, this idea of flagship project was a good one. But now, it's five years after, we have to do uh, in a more, I could say, normal way. It's, it's, it's like there is, for me, no difference. If you have shared objectives, this means that it is your own objective. And you have to deal with this so-called 
macro regional objective as it is your own objective, no, no in different ways. This means that you have to go through the usual process at national level, at regional level, at local uh, level, how you form your policy, how you implement it, how you select the project. It has not to be a different process, it has not to be a dual world, it has to be a unique and coherent way to try to develop and ensure the welfare of your uh, citizens.